so it is about well, eight in the morning and I am tired but whatever what you gonna do um I have some work to do but I intend on getting into finishing this um this scene that has been kind of giving me the blues and I don't know I'm in a good space and I'm back to actually writing again and writing every day and like knocking these words out um and I'm noticing that a lot of the emotional stuff that was already like pre-planned in the outline and stuff is really taking its toll on me like and I don't even know like if this is my form of therapy now but even the situations that I've never been in or the situations that are adjacent to me or the situations I may have pulled from a friend or family member or something I you know saw years ago like it's hitting me really hard <laughs> which is surprising um but I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying it. So I don't know if awesome things happen <laughs> that I um I, don't know, I just thought would make for good for a good story. But now uh, they got me in the trenches of my feelings, and I'm trying to dig my way out. So we're gonna get into some writing um, today and see what happens. So I just finished a sprint, but. 9647, which the way that this um, book is set up, that's actually um, like the entirety of a day. That's not one chapter. And so that put me at about this last sprint, about 20 minutes sprint, about 860 words. And I, um, I mean, it works, it's working, I'm happy for that, <laughs> for getting these words done. Um, I'm going to take me a break now and try to like distance myself from this, go jump into some housework or whatever else. Um, Cause I still, I don't know, I'm just feeling really good. So between the sprints I did last night and this one, I think I'm at about 4,000, no, no, 3,000 something words or whatnot, which chef's kid is good for me, but I have found a way to turn this scene around, and that is what was most important. So, all right, all right. So we back in the kitchen. <laughs> I'm tired, y'all. So I've been, um, I've been drafting and doing laundry and cleaning the kitchen and making lunch, like all this like little housekeeper stuff. And there is not enough hours in a day and not enough days in a week. Um, to sit and get this work done. This has really been a kind of chill morning. I'm done eat this food. <clears throat> I got actual work. To <laughs> I got work to do that I'm not even trying to touch. Um, so it's either sleep right or sleep then right, one or the other. And then try to continue. I don't even know. I'm just, <laughs> I have so much motivation to get stuff done, but I'm also dog tired, so. We'll see. I wish I had eyes in the back of my head. I've been working on my pride, but the rest of me cares. Every time I feel alive, it be loving me. Yeah. You my sinner, don't fold like it's vanity fair. Y'all don't pour the milk first? <laughs> <laughs> so I, um, I have a couple meetings this morning. It is uh, July 20th. I am tired. Um, I got a good night's sleep. I woke up extremely early. I pulled out my laptop and I looked at it and I read the last like couple paragraphs and I closed the thing and I went right back to sleep. Like it, it was not in the cards for me early this morning like I wanted it to be. Um, but I have these meetings this morning and I do not feel like being involved. I have not done anything but wake up. <laughs> and that's it so um it'll the meeting will be probably in the next actually the next hour so i'm gonna try to get some work done um on this i'm starting a new chapter and with the way that last chapter ended which okay so let's get into that so this last chapter that gave me the blues i am i worked through it so the issue i had with the one character who um 
was kind of, I didn't want it to go in the direction it was going where I felt like, oh, this makes him look worse than what I want him to look and actually kind of rectified itself. But there's a lot of cleaning up that I have to do. And where I would ordinarily be concerned with it, putting red marks and stuff, I'm like, man, this is, I'm just trying to get this draft done. So I really don't care. So again, what I'm going to do is what I always do, go highlight it in a very specific color. So I'll know to go back to that. Of course, I'll edit the whole <laughs> manuscript, but I want to. That in particular, some details that were added that I'm not happy with. Well, not, not gonna say not happy with that. I was kind of falling through. So I have an outline. I know what's gonna happen beginning, middle, and end, but I still have that pencil part of me that just fills in certain details, things that make sense, things that might pop up. And uh, for whatever reason, it's like, I knew they started here. I knew they were supposed to end up in this space. And then I kind of knew the trajectory because I had a couple points um, written down. But the way I got there was so clunky and some of the information will either be taken out altogether or it'll be added in a different part of the book. Another concern of mine is um, having, I want trauma and drama, but I don't want extremely heavy elements like i don't i want you to be able to read this and be like oh oh girl this happened or oh bro what's going on here but i don't want no like true crime type stuff and because i am a true crime consumer i some of that seeps in but with this i'm like oh some of these details have to be changed so um I think that'll go into the conversation of having a beta reader read over some of this information. And so that is, that is something. So we're going to eat this gourmet breakfast and <laughs> go to this meeting and get some writing done. So, all right. Do not ask me what vlog this is attached to. I am. Um, Waking up uh, a little bit later than I wanted to, and now I am about to dive back into this book. I have been going strong for a good little minute, and I'm trying to capitalize on that. I have some things I'm trying to do today. Um, it's Saturday, I think the 20th. The 22nd, Jesus Christ. Um, so yeah, we'll see. I, I need to get up. I gotta, I gotta get up. <laughs> I don't want to go to work today. I'd rather stay home and play video games. <laughs> so yeah, let me get up and, um, and get this, get some food and get the writing and yeah, give y'all an update hell. Every time that I be done, then I be running to you. It's a runner that I'm scared, but I'm calling you boo. Please don't ghost me, love me, hug me, hold me, see me, grow me. I see whole thing, bragging, boasting. Working on my pride, I've been working on my pride, yeah. I've been really scared, but then really trying, yeah. Never bite my tongue when there's something on my mind, yeah. Baby, you a gem, I never leave you under mine, yeah. Pray it's just a phase and we get it back in line, yeah. Love, pray you stay around me forever and never leave me We gon' get together forever, I know you need me 